Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Rogers Kaka Shungura YouTube channel. Kenyan politics is very interesting. And uh, if you do not take your time to understand what is really happening, you might get lost in between and blame the wrong people for wrong reasons. That is what I've come to learn myself. When Kenyan politics is driving to the east, the truth is in the west. The Kenyan politics can never drive to the east and the truth in that politics be driving at the same time towards the east. Unless in other countries, but to me, not in Kenya anymore. In the few days I've done politics, I have come to find one fact. As television politics runs towards the north, the reality in that politics is running towards the opposite direction. Kaka, I'm speaking in parables. Yes, I'm speaking in parables. But by the end of my presentation, you will understand what I'm talking about. What is happening currently in Kenya between Rigadi Gashawa, William Ruto, and Uru Kenyatta is not actually what many Kenyans know as I'm speaking. But today, I want to use the available information and tell you what is happening behind the curtains. I have seen several comments. Oh, Ruto is revenging on Uhuru. As much as I do not support Ruto, today I want to speak the reality and the truth. I have seen people say, oh, Ruto is badly treating Uhuru. Yes, but listen. The Jubilee fight is between only two people. Whatever you are seeing in Jubilee, the fracas you are seeing in Jubilee, the chaos you see in Jubilee, the blocking you saw today that a former president Uhuru Kenyatta has been blocked from accessing an NDC venue Third fight is not between Uhuru Kenyatta and William Ruto. That is for a fact. The fight that we are witnessing is between the former president Uhuru Kenyatta and regarding Ashawa himself. That is where the fight is. Regarding wants to show Uhuru Kenyatta that you humiliated me I don't know if he humiliated him, but according to regarding Ashawa's information, he says, Uru Kenyatta humiliated me, including arresting me in front of my kids and my wife. Now, Gashawa wants to ignorantly show that he is more powerful now than the Kenyatta who, according to him, humiliated him. Now, the little powers you are seeing in Kanini Kaga and Sabina Chege, they have been installed by Gashawa himself and not William Ruto. William Ruto is only celebrating because two sons are fighting. So Ruto, in his, in his capacity, he is only celebrating. And someone might ask Kaka, if you are saying the fight is between Ruth, is between Gashawa and Uhuru, why is Ruto not speaking about these issues? Ruto attacking Kwingiria Mambo ya familia. An attack wa Marizana wow. So that the blame does not come back to Ruto that you mistreated Uhuru Kenyatta. So Ruto is innocent in this matter. But happily quiet, 
seeing Gashawa and Ruto uh, Gashawa and Uhuru fight so i'm told today kanini kega has expelled jeremiah kioni uh, murad david and other jubilee leaders affiliated to the other party you know now jubilee has two teams one team led by uhuru kenyatta by jeremiah kioni another team led by gashawa via kanini kega but does gashawa know that he has no party in this country i don't know if gashawa sits and calls himself into a meeting and questions himself that unajua regardless sasa hivi akifukuzwa from uda he has no house to shed he is currently houseless and in any community a man or a son in a family who is not able to build his own house he is referred to as a careless man mwanaume yoyote katika familia ambaye hajajenga nyumba haheshimiwi so gashawa should understand that as much as he's fighting jubilee hana nyumba ya kuishi akifukuzwa kutoka UDA ana UDA ni ya wenyewe ndugu zangu UDA ina wenyewe UDA has owners gashawa is in someone's house you cannot fight while sheltering in your neighbor's house shame you cannot uwezi pia watu vita awezi pia wanaume vita ambao wamejenga makwao ili hali wewe unaishi kwa jirani haiwezekani ni aibu atikaka for example mimi nimejenga kwangu na niko na nyumba mtu ambaye anawekwa na jirani ati yako na gaps ya kuja kunipiga vita ati mbona nyumba yangu nimeiwachilia for the first place ha- hauna nyumba so kama hauna nyumba you have no more authority to question a man with his own house how uru is a man with his own house jubilee regarding a shower has no house to shelter he is houseless so how do you fight a man with a house what more authority do you have to fight a man with okay even if you win that jubilee where will you take it because it's not your house where will you take it you cannot be installed as a party leader you cannot so where are you taking jubilee you are fighting it yes how i wish you could have even formed your own village party so that as much as you fight jubilee your village party now picks njua kuna vita nyingine mimi naangalia nasema ni za kutowajibika sasa Rigadi anapiga jubili ndio. Anapopiga jubili, jubili kikufa, yeye anaenda wapi? Hana nyumba, hana pati. So where is he planning to shelter? Because uachana na UDA, UDA ni nyumba ya wenyewe. Na wakati uko kwa nyumba ya mwenyewe, mwenyewe akona authority ya kukwambia leo toka nataka kufagia. Leo toka naenda mazishi. Leo toka naenda safari na akiamua anaezana na ufunguo alale siku tatu kwa sababu you have no more authority otherwise to ask him mbona umelala na mimi niko nje you have no more authority kwa sababu amekuonea na amekusaidia so huyo anapopiga jubilee yeye anapanga kwenda wapi ndio anataka apige jubilee aimalize aizike lakini yeye anaenda wapi hana chama so before you begin fighting jubilee fast build your house gashawa kabla uweze kuboma nyumba ya mwenzako nyumba ya brada yako jenga kwako kwanza ndio uzinyeshewe ukifukuzwa lakini sasa wewe unataka kuboma kwa ndugu yako kwako hata mabati ya kujenga hauna hata misumari kilo moja ya kujenga haujanunua
But anyway, Ruto anafurahia kwa sababu yeye amefunika ngashawa blangeti. Waacha aendelee kulala usingizi. Siku moja akiamuka apate yudi yeye ili ilienda kitambo. Sijui atalilia nani, sijui atatorokea wapi. Ni ushauri wangu mdogo hata kama sitoshi mboga ya kumushauri. Kabla sio lazo gentlemen. See you in the next video. Asante sana.